So this is my 1987 International 9370 Eagle. Just picked it up yesterday. Drove her home for about five hours, no problem. It's got a big cam four. I was told uh, it was a 315 horsepower and it's been upgraded to 400 horse. Got the low flow cooling. It's got a newer 13 speed in it. It's got a 292 wheelbase. The rear is uh, like a 96, like a 9200 international cutoff. Air ride. This fuel tank, it's just for show, it's not hooked up. Have to get that hooked up eventually here. <clears throat> Eleven R twenty four fives. Got the big sleeper. What is it? A sixty inch fence. Needs some work, you know. His striker bolt got ripped out of there or something. Hundred sixty gallon fuel tank. Straight pipes. Jake brakes. It's got a tilt and telescopic steering wheel in here. This is a Super Eagle on the door there. Not too many people have uh, been able to tell me what exactly the Super Eagle package is. Some of these gauges don't work. Like the fuel gauge, that don't work. Ugh. Custom sleeper curtain there. Got a little, got a little tear in the sleeper boot. Needs fixed. You guys can't see a whole lot back here. Sleeper's not in the best shape on the inside. Got some cabinets over here. Truck has air conditioning. The AC works. Fuse panel box, the hinges are broke down here. Missing the ashtray. But it does have air wipers. The driver's side works. This one got an aftermarket radio up here. There's your wiper controls. But yeah, not a bad truck. Uh, Missing the accelerator pedal. Hoping to do some uh, power only work with it. Not quite ready to go yet, but seat belt's all broken. Could use a driver's seat, that's for sure. I could open the hood, but you guys know what a big cam for looks like. Definitely needs a new grill surround. Got the Kentucky Chrome going on.
yeah there it is didn't have any trouble driving it home let go of the wheel it straight as an arrow just needs some TLC You can see right there's the plate when they splice the frame together. Kind of, I don't know if they cut this ladder off to put this tank in. Because you guys know most internationals, the fuel tanks are up here. Both of them on each side. I'm guessing that's how this one was. It could use a new, some new mirror brackets. But I know a guy with a couple of these laying around in his yard, <clears throat> sitting in the weeds, so. Should be able to get her fixed up with some time and some money.